Greetings, Landroid users. In this video, I'm going to show what I think is a better way to mount the blades on your Landroid. Normally, the cutting blades are attached to the cutting disc with a screw in such a manner that the blades are free to rotate around the screw as the cutting disc turns. However, after a few lawn mows, cut grass can easily coil around underneath the blade and prevent it from rotating as it was designed. The following brief video first shows the way that the uh, manufacturer wants you to mount the blade and it is subject then to this problem. However, following that is a brief pictorial or video that shows the way I found to mount the blade that will prevent the grass, the cut grass, from stopping the blade to rotate. In other words, it will keep the blade free to recoil under the cutting action. The Landroid blade is placed over a hub, a small hub, on its cutting disc and then screwed down as shown here. However, this leaves very little space under the blade and therefore cut grass will get caught in that space and freeze the blade from turning. Now the second way that I've learned, the better way, is to get a small washer, a number six screw washer, that uh, prevents the blade from falling over its hub so that when you screw it down with the washer in place it can't it, it rides on top of the washer and on top of its hub. And with this situation, there is enough space underneath the blade that grass cannot trap and prevent the blade from freely rotating around its mounting screw. So this is the purpose of this video to show these better way to mount Landroid mower blades so that grass will not impinge or freeze the blade. Note the space that is now left between the bottom of the blade and the cutting disc.